What's up guys and welcome back to Broken Age. In the last episode we played as Vela and things ex happened so excitingly that I'm not even in the mood to play as Shay. Everything's happening in Vela's side and not so much Shay's. But with that being said though, maybe we should try to make some progress as Shay to spruce things up here and hopefully we can keep getting some momentum going. I'm not really sure though, but the only way to find out is to go for it, right? <laughs> So I think the one thing that we have to do right now is that there's still more stuff we can talk to back at the old, the, the one dude, I always forget his name, the balding space guy. We need to talk to him a bit more because I feel like there's just more to accomplish there. And there's more to talk to there because I remember leaving, just sort of getting bored of what he was saying. So hopefully he'll have more to talk to when we get over there. Like a bucket of fingers. Hmm. I think I know that one. Well, let me just draw you a quick diagram. She's giving us hints to on Nana, then. Well, I can't seem to find anything to draw with. Oh, no. I'm sorry. I guess I'm of no use after all. Hmm. Hang on. I'll be right back with a writing utensil. So, if we can find her something to write with, we can help. she can help us unknot stuff. I don't have anything really right now, but maybe we can talk to you, Mr. Man. Mr. Dad. Dad? Son. At least now we have a plan. Right, Dad? Well... Half of one at least. If our ship's headed to Laruna on autopilot, and if we can fix Alex's ship and hitch a ride there with him, then all we have to figure out is what to do when we get there. Right. Hmm. What's cooking? Found some fermented biomatter here. Perfect enzymatic base for my patented hull patch formula. Only problem is, I can't add the bonding agent until I know I have the pH balanced perfectly or the whole batch will be ruined. How's the whole patch coming? Great, except I can't add the final ingredient until I know I have the pH balanced correctly. Okay then, well, how can we help with that? How would you change the pH anyway? I've added all the calcium carbonate I could get my hands on just to lower the acidity and raise the pH to be somewhere in the ballpark but I need to know it's exactly seven before I put in the final ingredient. Can't you just do a taste test or something? My taste buds aren't that sensitive. Also, I put poison in there. Oh my. What? Well, it's usually to keep space parasites from chewing on the patch. Force of habit, I guess. How'd you get the calcium carbonate? By grinding up every seashell on the beach, but I fear it's still not enough. Where can I get more calcium carbonate? That's a great question. If I could find just one more shell, that would help. Good luck, Dad. I think mm -hmm. I know who could help with that. Mr. Mayor Man feels like, I feel like he would know where some shells are, but <laughs> he's still choking on stuff. Um, we need to find something to hit him with so that he coughs that out, right? We're still looking for that too. There's just still so much we gotta do, oh gosh. Um, let's give this a shot though. Do you know how to repair hexapals? That sounds like a no. Oh no. But he has a shell in his throat or something like that, I think. Or at least he'll know where shells are, like all those behind him. Well, let's give the hexapal to our father. He might know what to do. Dad, do you know how to repair this little guy? Hmm, let me take a look. Ooh, Ooh. gosh. This fellow has had a lot of his wiring knocked out. Not much I can do here, I'm afraid. Okay, I feel like the Hexapal is gonna be our boots mission for Shay. Yeah, it's not gonna be fun. You'll know what I mean if you watched the last episode, but... Oh boy, hmm. Let's go up here though and let's talk to Mr. Man and see what else we can sort of get figured out. I'm trying to figure out as much as possible here. So hello, how are you? So what else does your ship need to fly? Hmm, let me see here. Still need an electronics genius and uh... Still need your dad to patch the holes in the hull. What else? I still need a radiation suit. Hmm. Haven't found a superconductive gyroscopic hypercam yet. And... Gotta replace my heavy-duty anti-gravity thrust unit. Once we take care of that, we'll be ready to fly. On it. Okay, that's a lot of stuff. Who do you think has been looting your ship? Actually, I suspect the guards outside. Something about their outfits. Hmm. There aren't any guards out there. Walked off the job, eh? Man, 300 years ago, people were a lot more professional, I'll tell you what. What was it about your guards' outfits that made you suspicious? Did they look like they were hiding loot underneath? 
No, it was the way they were made from the same material as my radiation shielding blast curtains. Oh. <laughs> That's silly. What's a superconductive gyro what's it can? A superconductive gyroscopic hypercan. A small but critical part of the ship's controls. Here, I'll, I'll draw you a detailed schematic. That would be helpful, actually. Thank you. Okay. I'll see if I can find one lying around. Can I borrow your space pencil? Uh, it's just a regular pencil, but okay. Oh yeah, space pencils. So, what kind of help do you need with the wiring? I need an electrical genius who can get into small spaces, knows how to solder, and who can memorize circuit boards at a glance. Hmm. Okay, yeah, that's not me. I'll find somebody. I don't know. Okay, see you later. Okay. Possibly the lumberjack? I don't even know. Uh, can you do this? How about this little guy? Would he help? On my ship, they were good at fixing all kinds of things, especially electronics. Incredible. Much more advanced than the units I'm used to. He's probably exactly what we need, but it looks like he needs some rewiring, and that tech is way beyond me. Hmm. All right then, so... Ooh, there's a music sheet over here. I wonder what this is about. Uh, what's this? Ooh, um, I have no clue. All right then. Um, moving forward though. Uh, there's not too much else to do here. We can check out this stuff. Hey, you got this old timey laser coil and amplifying quartz all hooked up wrong. Want me to? No, no, don't touch them. They've come close to overheating several times, and they're extremely unstable. I'll, I'll get around to fixing that soon. Just leave it to me. Okay. Yeah. All right, all right. <laughs> Jeez, we can't do anything around here. Let's split this joint then and see what else we can do. So there, we still, our to-do list gets bigger, but our accomplish list still stays the same, which is no good. Um, do we have anything else we can hit somebody, some him with? I guess we have the pencil now, so we can move forward with that. Let's see. Hey, I found a pencil. Oh, great. Hand it over, honey. Now, what was I gonna draw for you again? Oh, yeah. Untying knots. Hmm. hmm. I think I know that one. Here's a diagram. Follow those instructions exactly. Oh, you'll have a totally different knot on your hands. Oh my. Nice. So, can I can I read this? This diagram is good for one thing. Untying oh, knots. Oh no. I don't like the look of this one. Can I get a new one? Can I just get a brand new one? Oh, that's so nice to hear. Hey, can I get another knot untying diagram? I know I just got one from you, and I haven't tried it yet, but I want another one. What for? Uh, no reason, actually. I guess I should go try this one. But I don't wanna. Okay, let's talk to her about something else, because it does look like she has other topics we can talk about. Did you say you had wire? I have a bunch, but I'm using it all up trying to make these dang hooks. Hmm. Okay, then, uh... Where did Mog Chothra go? Yeah, that was weird. Guess he wasn't dead after all. He just up and flew oh, out of here. Reminds me of everything Probably that happened last episode. Probably with his tail between his legs. Where is Mog Chothra's home? They say he comes from over the plague dam. Must be some mama Mog over there popping out fresh monsters every 14 years or so. Maybe, maybe not. Hey, do you know anything about electronics? Oh no. I only work with wire to reinforce the cloud shoes I make. A correction. Used to make. Ooh, she's loving a new life. Alright then, so we're going to head out then. I guess the best thing to do then would be to go over here and to uh, start doing stuff with that. Uh, what's, I don't know, it's just like there's so much to do, like I said. And so little things getting done, and it drives me nuts, because I just don't know too much how to make progress with all of it. Maybe if we uh, go back over to Dudeman, I want to show him... One thing, the hexapal, and see what he says about it. Hey, can you fix tiny robots? No, but I could make you a new one if I had the mold. Also, it would be kind of on the statue end of the robot spectrum. Hmm. Well, what about this? Hey, do you think you could use your metal works there to make me one of these? Man, that is one cool looking candle holder. I'd love to make you one, but I work for molds, not diagrams. Sorry. Well, maybe somebody can make us a mold, then. Oh boy, <laughs> we're making so little progress. Here, have a cupcake. Want a cupcake? No, thanks. I bought a dozen from this family doing a fundraiser, and I ate, like, 
all of them. Oh no. Wow. Well, I wanted to do my part. You're a great addition to the community, aren't you? All right then, let's see what else we can do. Maybe we can go back to Cloudville and get some more accomplished there now that we have a little bit more stuff. There's this, I don't know. I just, I, we gotta use the unknotting diagram and see what we can get accomplished with it. And see if that can like help us figure out this knot stuff because this knot is not fun. <laughs> all right then, so. How does that big cloud start? All right, so I did get a new um, diagram. Okay. So, it does like look like a cow's udder, so that's how I described the carol. Um, make the boat go under the bridge, tickle the foot, unravel the sweater, or poke the clown in the eye. Um, I'm gonna say it's make the boat go under the bridge, because that's sort of what it looks like. It's definitely not a foot. It's not a sweater. That's the one. That's number two. Number two is the sweater. Um. Yeah, let's go for, uh, it might be an eyeball. Oh gosh, I have no clue. Let's just do the, the, Make the bridge. Make the under the bridge. Okay, that's, that was a bad Why was it a bad idea? idea? Uh, what does it look like now? Well, uh, I don't know if it was a bad, uh, like a whole new town. Oh no, um. Okay, I guess that's it. I don't know what to, oh brother. Let's just, I don't know. Let's give that. Not uh, yeah, it's just broken now. So I need to go get a new diagram. I don't know. This is crazy. All right, let's give it another try. Number one, she loves me. She loves me not. Pull apart the fighting snakes, or make the water come out of the cup, or make the boat go under the bridge. Is it really any of these? Because I don't think it is, to be honest. I'm not sure. Once again, none of these describe the pictures going on. What's funny is, is we've been getting descriptors for pictures that aren't showing up here, but though it's, I feel like something's not making sense here just for the fact that it's not making sense. It's like, the puzzles are starting to get monotonous, and at this point, I'm gonna try to guess one more time. Pull off and see please. what happens. Gotcha. Hmm. I don't think uh, that was right. Apparently, nope. Okay, then with that being said, then we'll have to try it. I'll have to sit here and... Work away at it over and over What's again like this time? until, yeah, at least now it teleports me back, which is nice, but I don't even know. <laughs> I think we're going to try it in the next episode. We'll do a little bit like you. A little bit like you, strangely enough. Hmm. I think I know that one. Here's a diagram. Follow those All right, let's see if this works. I I'm guessing it won't. But it'll be worth a shot. We'll give this a shot, and if not, then one the episode, and I'll just painstakingly try it off screen. Because I don't want to cut the video out 20% of the time, you know? So, um, let's see. Um, what do we got? Uh, make the baby play patty cake. Okay, that looks like the number one. Make the baby play patty cake. Okay. I think we're getting somewhere. That's good. Number two is... What is that? I'm not sure what number two is. Um, I gotta, I keep on having to think about this. All right, then I think number two has to be like pull the finger. Let's find pull out. The finger. Yep. Hey, that did something. Oh my, we're actually getting somewhere. And now that third one is totally make the boat go under the bridge. There's a boat there. The boat this is gonna work, really? I think I see what you mean. That loosened up something somewhere, I think. Okay, God. it's doing hey, it! Get your oh back. my gosh! Whoa! What the heck? Avert your eyes! Never! Brother, get me a towel. It's a whole bunch of nice things! Brother Lightbeard, what is all that stuff? I know it looks like a big hoarding junk pile, but you have is. to understand. I might need some of this stuff someday. But everything you said about lightness, I... I don't know what I believe. Just don't believe him. You get a line and I'll get a pole, honey. You get a line and I'll get a pole. This is bad. This hey, is very bad. Is that a heavy-duty anti-gravity thrust unit right there? Yep. I have no idea, but you're welcome to take it. What? The, no, that's mine. My likeness. As a matter of fact, is there any place you'd like it delivered? To me. Yep. This came from my ship. Someone must have looted it while I was asleep. 
You sure you don't want to ride over the plague dam with us, Father? No. I need to go take care of Harmony. Ooh, Goodbye, beat him up. Space Boys. That was weird. Yeah. Indeed. I mean, it's nice to look young, but I'm obviously a grown man, right? Uh, what? F what did that have to do with any of it? But, okay! Right was as I was about to give up. We were shined upon with knowledge and mostly luck. So thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure to give it a like and share with your friends and family and comment in the comment section below what do you think about some of the crazy things we did in this episode. By the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.